And do you realize that every one of us has been impacted by something? We are here for a reason. That reason is connected to our belief. And the reason is connected to the fact that we are Muslims. And the reason is connected to the fact that we consider ourselves fortunate to be from among the followers of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam chosen by Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala. That's the reason. Had it not been for the deen of Allah, we would not have been here. Had it not been for the gift of Allah Almighty that he sent his most beloved, the best of creation, the most noble of all prophets, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, to us, we would not have been here. And this is the reason why the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam has a rank higher than anyone else. Quite simple. If I can break it down and re-explain it. He says to us, Man sanna sunnatan hasanatan falahu ajruha wa ajru man amila biha ila yawmil qiyamati la yanqusu dhalika min ujurihim shay'an. Whoever sets a good example or teaches something good will have a reward not only for that good, but for everyone who followed that good right up to the day of judgment without a decrease in anyone's rewards. So if you teach me something, you get a reward for every time I benefit from it or do what you taught me and then when I teach 10 others you are getting a reward for 11 and when each one of them teaches 10 others you are getting a reward for 110 and when each one of them teach another 10 you are getting a reward for thousands and thousands and millions and billions and trillions of people who came onto the earth from that time to the end of time and here is Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam he taught us La ilaha illallah Muhammadur Rasulullah Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam Imagine the reward he is clocking and getting for every single good deed that every single Muslim has done from the time of the Sahaba radiallahu anhum the millions and the billions of Muslims who have existed thus far, including the billions on earth right now for every sajda that takes place at every moment across the globe, who is getting the reward? Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Every goodness that you engage in, that is brought to you by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, through Nabi Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, his status is being elevated as we speak and as we breathe and as our hearts are beating. Yet he already had the highest status prior to him even being sent to us. Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. It is impossible for us to imagine the reward, the blessings, the status that Allah has bestowed upon his favorite, upon the best of creation, the most noble of all prophets of Allah. And this is why to have chosen him as the final messenger is also one of the greatest honors of Allah.